welcome back. So it's a little bit windy outside, and we might see some light flurries a little bit later. Yeah, just a little bit, like literally a flake or two. <laughs> a flake or two. A flake or two. <laughs> Nothing to uh, get in a tizzy about. Pretty much like we had earlier, there was a few flurries for a little bit, and then it stopped. So we could see that happen one more time tonight before we wake up tomorrow morning. So nothing to worry about. We're looking at some clouds right now in uh, Storm Lake. No flurries there now. Uh, and the roads are looking a little bit better than they have in the last few days. The same thing in downtown Sioux City on the Port Neal Welding Company. Skycam HD. If you could see the flag in there in the darkness between the lights, uh, you could see it is still whipping in the wind. It was whipping earlier today. We had some gusts and we're still seeing some of those gusty winds that's keeping us so so warm. But uh, there's that flag whipping in the wind on the Port Neal Welding Company, Skycam HD. 37 degrees, that was our high today, warmer than normal. We were much warmer than normal on that morning low as well. We'll stay in the mid to upper 20s through the overnight tonight with those winds and the clouds keeping us uh, warm there. 36 degrees right now with clouds and a northwest wind sustained at 21 miles per hour in Sioux City. I'm showing you the visibility because earlier when we had the flurries coupled with some wind, we did drop a few miles, but right now we're doing A-OK. -okay. So if we do get a few flurries to redevelop through the overnight tonight, the winds will still be kicking. Just be careful for some small pockets of low uh, visibility on the roads. Otherwise, temperatures are still in the 30s. This is pretty much what they look like during our 6 o'clock show, so the clouds and winds keeping them very steady here. 36 in Sioux City, 35 in Takima, Para 3s in Wayne. Wind chill right now in the teens and 20s because of that wind. 25 is your real feel in Sioux City. Here's the sustained winds from the northwest. 21 miles per hour in Sioux City, 17 in Takema. We are seeing some gusts get up to 25, close to 30 miles per hour. We're gusting to 26 right now in Sioux City. So there were those light flurries earlier, pretty much hit that I-29 corridor. Clouds are left behind, and we're going to stay in this cloudy pattern for the next few days as this uh, kind of upper shape to the atmosphere doesn't move much, and that will just keep the clouds in there. So cloudy and mild for us through the overnight. Night temperatures staying in the upper 20s and lower 30s. Some flurries possible earlier in the evening, and then those clouds uh, will remain throughout the after throughout the night and into tomorrow afternoon. With those temperatures getting warmer than normal, tomorrow temperatures will be warmer than normal in the upper 30s, lower 40s on Monday with some pockets of sunshine, and then. Will uh, be cooler throughout the rest of the week, right around normal, not terribly cold, but around normal. Some viewers say that the sky should loosen up. The 30s aren't too cold, but it is a little bit cooler than we have in the last two days. So, Stormcast HD has just very few flurries through the overnight hours, maybe one or two flakes. Those clouds will linger for us through the day tomorrow. Then by Monday, we'll uh, have some clouds in the area and breezy winds as this clipper, a system from the north, is going to skip southward and eastward. We'll stay dry, no snow for us, but our friends in Wisconsin uh, and uh, Michigan there will see the snow and we'll see some breezy winds and clouds because of it. So tonight, the snow forecast very light. A lot of goose eggs around on this map. Maybe a half an inch if you do happen to see flurries, but other than that, uh, no accumulation tonight. So 29 degrees, a few flurries, very cloudy and uh, mild. Those winds still up to 20 miles per hour for tomorrow. Stubborn clouds and a steady breeze. We'll get a temperature up to 36 degrees tomorrow. 41 on Monday with more breezy winds, gusts to 30 miles per hour. And then those clouds hang around through the week as those temperatures get back down into the lower 30s. But it could be worse. This time last year, Groundhog's Day, which is only a few days away, mm -hmm. we were buried in 13 inches of snow. I so remember that. Yeah. <laughs> Take your pick. Yeah, well, I was going to say, we're already doing better from, you know, last year. So, yeah, yeah we got some warmer temperatures, I guess, to yeah. look forward to. Not a horrible start to February. Yeah. <laughs>